I mentioned how you in a lower frequency will be lost in the matrix. How everything you uh, know and think will pretty much be a lie. And uh, how this lie will completely wrap you in. And what you start doing as you especially now that the truth is out and you can simply just uh, use that information that have been given to you and do the steps that are necessary for you to break free you will be able to open a, a better sort of self-connection if you take these uh, things that have been said you puzzle them together you will be able to resonate with it and open up um, a path for you to be able to recognize this truth. And you have now realized that it's all about being in the moment, which you really haven't been very much able to do earlier in life, because you have been completely wrapped in. And the the amount of moment you have been able to experience have been pretty insignificant. And you will recognize that as you raise your frequency, you will step more and more and more into the moment. And ultimately, that is what you would want to do with all areas of life. You want to be depolarized. You don't want to have anything that pull you out of the moment and into a dualistic world. You want to be neutral to everything, so you can completely be in the moment. And uh, in the beginning, as you're reaching 9-11, it's not about doing all of the work so you can be in 9-11. It's about doing the necessary work so you can be in 9-11, so you can truly experience the moment. And from there on, you will be very good at doing this work about letting go of the duality and uh, becoming neutral within these areas of life that you previously have been uh, polarized within. So you raise your frequency enough so that you can be able to stay in the moment and experience the moment. Be here and now. And then you take care of the things that are upsetting you the most. So you can be in the moment to the best degree possible. And it really is that simple. The more you want to accomplish, the more work you will have to do. The more you have to deal with the duality or with lower frequency comprehensions of things so that you can be in the moment about those things if you could ultimately just be then you would gain all of the knowledge about absolutely everything it would just light up to you like like anything you have known previously that would be of the source truth but um, you would need to be very, very accomplished to have that ability. But like I said, to start off with, you will simply just stay in the moment and fully commit to it. Stay centered, neutral, here and now in the moment. And if you then notice something that is pulling you out or upsetting you or you recognize that you have strong emotions about something then you deal with it and if you don't well then it might take you down then you will decrease the amount of the presence here and now that you will be able to experience and that's why it's so important to commit to the journey to realize this truth it is about being here and now because we are experiencing a matrix illusion where you have different minds. You have the subconscious mind, the conscious mind, 
the physical mind, emotional mind and so on. And our ultimate achievement would be to break free from the mind, to be truly here and now in the moment to the highest degree of what you possibly can as source, to be completely neutral, to be completely happy, to be completely joyful. And uh, it's not necessarily about knowing as much stuff as possible unless they are within the things that will satisfy you. And by that I mean, what areas of life are you experiencing? If you can be neutral and highest frequency within those areas of life, well then you will be truly empowered. And from there on, who knows what else you would want to learn later on. You don't need to know exactly how a car engine works, unless that is something that you truly want to know and something that you think about and have anything to do with. But if you didn't know it, and that is something that you have a lot to do with, and you are practicing staying in highest frequency, neutral here and now in the moment, then the lack of knowledge about the car engine would pull you out. It would simply be a cloud that you have to deal with. And you must then figure out how a car engine works. Because you truly care about it and you spend a lot of time in the day thinking about it or having anything to do with it. So deal with whatever you care about. Deal with whatever your life experience is about. Because if you don't, well then that will be one of the hindrances that are hindering you from being. From being here and now, which is the greatest experience. It is uh, a far, far greater experience than being upset or confused or sad or overthinking. Ultimately, you don't even want to think. You want to know. But to get there, you will have to do the work, which might involve some thinking and uh, high frequency choices. And that's the game, really. It's that simple. If you can take care of all of these clouds, if these clouds only represent what your life experience is about, then you will experience phenomenal empowerment and freedom and clarity. And if you then suddenly want to learn more about, let's say, how to walk the line, put up a line between two trees, and you want to master it, you want to become phenomenally good at walking back and forth on the line, then you might realize that you don't know how to do it. You don't know what things you need to be aware of for you to master walking on the line. And uh, of course now, the space around you is completely clean, which means that you have done a lot of work. You have become very good at gaining awareness of things that are relevant within the things that you have gained empowerment within. So yeah, in the beginning, you might experience a cloud here. You want to learn to walk the line. You don't know how to do it because you're not aware of the things that are important. And you don't have the practice while having those things into um, awareness. But you can probably deal with this one very quickly now. Uh, honestly, in a few seconds. And um, what do you want to gain clarity about next? Because now you have become incredibly powerful. But you don't have to know absolutely everything in the world to be in 9-11. You just need to gain clarity about, about the game, how it works. 
you need to have some good self-awareness about your programs and you need to have dealt with many of them. You cannot have things in your day that completely pull you out of the moment and upset you because uh, that would only mean that you had work that you need to do to be able to experience the moment to this high degree that you ultimately want to. So do the work, stay aware, recognize what is triggering you, what is upsetting you, and deal with it. Just learn to, to not be polarized about it. Learn to be absolutely fine with it. And whatever it should be, do the work if it is something that you are thinking about or something that is upsetting you. You should ultimately want to experience a life where you can be neutral to all things. And especially the things that your life has anything to do with.